Hi friends, and for those that are new here, I'm Patrick. I am exploring a year of plant-based wellness that intersects with my personal growth, my little family here at home, and the communities that I navigate in and around. And for the last year, I have been roughly fleshing out different angles to explore on this plant wellness theme of mine for the year. And a lot of it has been sort of slow moving in my opinion. And uh, as of a couple weeks ago, I finally have intersected with something that has drastically improved and helped shift my mental health and well-being and personal growth and overall sense of, I don't know, something something has shifted in a really great way. And I'm really excited about sharing what that was that shifted me. But I'm also very eager to sort of show the progression through it. And because of how this change has come to find me, it sort of abruptly interrupted my workflow uh, with sharing videos and I really feel bad about that. I have a lot of fun putting together different ideas. I like engaging with everyone on different social platforms. Uh, it's been really, well, it's been a really great asset to have because this has become one of those communities that I'm navigating in for all of this. And I just want to add that I'm going to be sharing over the next couple of weeks a couple of videos that I have already filmed and edited quite a bit whiles. A, a whiles? It's not even a word. I have, I have filmed and edited a little bit ago and I feel like it's important to share the progression of that of the story of where I was coming from before I got to where I was to where I'm at now I'm going to try and aggressively work through that sharing of the process because I'm currently right now working on a uh, more thorough update to what it is that has changed for me and uh, I'm also going to be sharing a couple of other things. I had some goals for the year. Um, I had a very up and down growing season and that's because of, you know, again, distractions and you have to let go, you can't hold on to everything. And unfortunately my garden had suffered a lot this year, but we also had a very intense rain year. So weeds got out of control. Uh, but production was also something that got out of control. So today is a was a productive day for me. I'm covered in uh, I'm covered in mud from doing one of our spaces in the house. But also today was the autumn equinox, which I always find a very restorative day. So I was out in the garden doing what I shared with you guys last year. I filmed some of that to show you what I'm actually is one of probably the last really big hauls from our garden space. Uh, production wise, I did get, uh, I think I'm about at my goal of a ton of, an actual ton, not like a ton, actual 2000 pounds of produce for my local food banks. The twist in that is my actual local food banks aren't taking donations from like private people, only established connections of what they work with. So my donations have gone further out away from me, which has been a little bit of a hurdle. And so I'll share some of that too. I have some plant something Sundays that I'm going to squeeze in because you know now's the time of year where you are thinking, you're already thinking for next year. So you do your seed planting, all of that stuff in the winter for thinking about your vegetables and your annuals and your soft perennials. But now's the time of the year where you think about like more of those perennial and long-term production plants like trees and shrubs and uh, landscaping goals. I have some random plant something Sundays that, and not just that one little garden space I focused in last year of which I'm going to give an update of because it's really coming together and taking shape. And I'm trying to think. Oh, and I have some exciting other new things that I plan on sharing with you that include uh, addressing sort of fears in my personal growth, but it opens up a new community uh, and continued personal growth area of exploration. Um, and I have
have some upcoming things that are yet to be filmed. So lots of rambling, lots of excitement, but <laughs> I am hoping to catch up on where I was to be where I'm at at present by maybe hopefully the end of October, early November. And then I have already some aspirations and goals swinging into the like next calendar year. Um, and I don't know why I keep throwing up air quotes throughout this entire video. These are real things that I'm talking about. But uh, I'm just over excited to share things. It's been a while since I've connected. And again, I've had some really big, quick, unexpected, but well desired changes. And this is the place where I'm excited to share them. So. If you don't know who I am, subscribe. <laughs> and if you already know who I am, I'm excited to continue to share with you and re-engage on this platform. So I guess I'm gonna awkwardly wrap this up and say I look forward to sharing more with you soon. Tschüss.